let's talk about Uber uh, going on the Tesla AB API, which is kind of interesting because, um, you know, the robotaxi is supposedly coming soon at some point. <laughs> um, but you know what? Honestly, okay, I don't have a Tesla. I don't mind them. I'm not a fan of EVs, but I they have their place. Absolutely. Um, they're great for rideshare driving. Um, you know, th there's a lot of greatness to it. And honestly, I think this is a, a fantastic opportunity for those who own them. And uh, you're, you're able to get Uber on it. Uh, when I drive Uber, I don't use my phone anymore. I use my iPad Pro. And it's the, I have the 12-inch screen. Plop, plop that right in a holder. And you, you got both apps running side by side. It's great. It's bigger. Um, you know, it's just good. So personally, I like that. And then having the monitor on these cars where they are already bigger, um, you have it right there. So it's per to me, I think it's perfect. What do you guys think? What do you think, to, uh, Sergio? I, no, I like this, actually. I think yeah. this is uh, this is definitely a good step forward. Um, I mean, you have that big ass screen in the car. What do you need the cell phone, mm -hmm. whatever for? So I, I think it's a cool idea. Um, exactly. I like yeah. it. Uh, I like it a lot more so too, because we all know some of the routes by Uber are not the best and they take you in weird different ways. And you always have that backseat driver trying to tell you, oh, go here, turn there. You know, when it's on a bigger screen, you kind of get that less. I don't know if you use a tablet or not, but you kind of get that no, less, like they actually see the route more. Um, and the same thing, if they're going to be in the back of the car here and they're on uh, seeing the big thing, your, your big monitor, I don't, I don't know. How big are they on, on, them like 16 inches or something like that no bigger than inches. that tesla, tesla okay. model threes are pretty big and uh the model y's are more uh vertical than horizontal but they're massive screens yeah. bro yeah so that's one thing people are going to see that screen and then they will not be that backseat driver they might like see it and say hey you know this route is actually a little bit better or something so it's going to be a little bit more constructive versus backseat driver um mm -hmm. but i like it i think that's great and then uh, yeah, if you got full self-driving, hey, that might work better. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, um, no, this is a good idea. I like this. Um, yep. I don't have a Tesla yet, but hey, one of these days, I, I, I'll, I'll, I'll do a ride share with a Tesla. I mean, they're cheap, oh. yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, uh, actually, uh, there's a link in the description where you can get a thousand dollars off a Tesla if you're interested. Uh, so if you're interested, link's going to be in the description below. Uh, Ridesharegrad.com/slash/tesla. So you could get a, a 1K off and Model Ys are starting under 30K right now. So I, that's not too bad. Terry, I know you're the TLDR, I know. But, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, you know, you know, we can do some good content for Tesla. You know, get me one. You know? Yeah, give me one too. Yeah. I actually yeah no, East Coast, West Coast. It's good. I have a you know, what, color, what color would you like, Chris? Oh, what color would you uh, like? What color would you? Uh, want? If I did, I would probably want blue. Blue. I want the black. Black and black, so I can do black. Well, black. black would be great, but I don't have black. We don't have Uber black here. No, lift so, black. or or lift black or anything. You so, have that? Oh no. no. So it wouldn't matter. Um, I have. Well, I have the black pilot. My Evo oh. is graphite gray. So I got. I got that. I'd like a little color in my life right. too. Right, um, cool. so I, I think I would go with the blue. I mean, if we ha if we had black here, oh, absolutely, I would go with black. But, yeah, I will. Uh, so Harry, yeah, TLDR, but you know, once in a while, you drop in and watch like eight seconds of a show. You know, add it to the five hundred people that are watching. It's okay, but all I'm telling you is, um, I, you know, we would do some good content if Harry gets me a Tesla. I mean, <laughs> drive, get me one to drive around for like a year, and then, you know, I'll do some forty-hour tests to see how good things are in California, Harry. You know what I mean? <laughs> One thing I always say is work smarter, not harder. If you aren't using the solo app, then you may be working harder. So let's change that. Download the app, link your accounts where you can manage your income, track your expenses, and project your taxes. Not only that, but you can plan by optimizing your time, make more, and even guarantee your daily pay with guaranteed earnings. Download solo and begin to work smarter, not harder today. Link is in the description. All right, let's get back to it. Oh yeah, I, I would definitely do gas versus electric all that good stuff savings sure. difference um yeah i would definitely do that yeah cool i couldn't do that yeah there you go rst they love watching the map absolutely 100 yeah. percent. same thing like i say i, I have the the 12 inch uh, ipad tablet and i put i pop that in 
And it's a lot better than my uh, seven and a half inch screen on my uh, pilot. But I mean, that's, that's what they're looking at. They're looking right at it. And then you got both apps open up at the same time. So instead of like having to swipe over or something, you just go on off, on off, wherever you need to do it. So it's so much easier phones. in my opinion. I have two phones, one on one, on one uh, air conditioning, you know, duct and one on the other one. And, hmm. but then, you know, I, I think, I think it may be time though. I think that's a great idea. Have like a iPad, half the screen is Uber, half the screen is Lyft, right? We could do that, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, um, it's, it's a little different because Lyft is like the same vertical resolution as your phone. So that doesn't okay. go bigger, um, but you can um, resize the Uber app. So yeah, I have cool. Lyft like in the vertical resolution all the way over to the one side and then Uber is on the other, but it's the full screen. Um, right. So it's it shows, I might make a video on that. Yeah. If you guys are interested on how it's set up and all that, um, I definitely like it a lot better in my opinion. It It's just better, it's bigger. It's easier to use. You're not fumbling over a smaller screen. You don't accidentally click something as much. Um, so it's, I, I think, a lot better. Is it worth renting doing an electric car anymore in SoCal? Um, if you're going to rent an EV from Uber, but the downside is you can, once you rent either from Uber and Lyft, you can only do Uber and Lyft. You cannot do both. If you if you can find a company that's going to rent you a car that you can do multiple apps, or by all means, I think you should or you could. I mean, you have to drive full time, obviously, um, but you know, just doing one, I don't think is the right thing at the moment, especially in Southern California. Anyway, so. Yep. All right. Well, uh, what do you guys think about that? If you drive a Tesla, you like that? Then it's going to be on your uh, monitor now instead on your car directly through the Tesla API. Right. Make a video. Okay. All right, thanks for watching. That short little clip was from our live stream, Show Me the Money Club with Sergio and myself. Tuesdays, 6 p.m. Eastern, 3 p.m. Pacific. Make sure you subscribe, turn on all notifications so you'll be notified when we go live, as well as all of our awesome content. Make sure to check out this video right here, which will take you to the entire live stream, or check out this video right there. All right, drive smart, everyone.